Welcome to Silver Bar Stacker, folks. I hope everybody's doing well and enjoying their Monday. That's right, folks. Today is Monday, and it is a brand new year. So I want to first start off by wishing you all a very happy new year, and I hope you had a good time leading into the end of the year. I know uh, I wouldn't say that I was partying very hard, but I was definitely relaxing all the way to the end of the weekend, and I was doing a lot and lot and lot of work. So, you know, I had a lot of goals that I wanted to accomplish kind of leading into the end of the year, and I wouldn't say I accomplished everything that I wanted to accomplish, but I made some dang good progress. Uh, One of the things that I wanted to really do was because we here at SBS really sort of specialize in very specific kind of more well-known refiners, one kind of my goals of the website generally is to always have especially the more common examples i want to always have that available at any given time and so here you see a lot of those common 10 ounce bars for example 10 ounce bars is something that i was focusing on and making sure i was getting all the examples up on the website and i'm happy to say that yep they're all up there now right if you want any of the common Ninglehart or johnson matthew bars there's all these weird different types right even if just the common ones right I've got a lot of rare ones on the website as well, and those have been there for quite a while, but I was really making a concerted effort to get all the common ones up there. So right now, as far as Engelhardt and JM goes, all the one ounce and 10 ounce varieties of all the common stuff is available right now. You can get them all at pretty reasonable prices as well, because I've gone through each and every single item and kind of looked at the market price right now to try to price it as competitively as humanly possible. So actually you'll find that, especially once you factor in the discounts that some of our gold Uh, silver and copper tier subscribers get on their purchases i mean our gold tier subscribers are getting 15 percent off of everything blanket off of everything on the website and so that's why you might think that hey the prices are a little bit high i mean the prices are actually not that high if you compare them with the market and you actually do your research even with without factoring in that extra 15 5 to 15 percent off that the monthly subscribers get the prices are still pretty dang good i mean if you really think about it i mean maybe for some of the more rare things uh that really are a lot of times unobtainable anywhere besides our website some of those things might be a little bit on the pricey side right like i mean just as an example like if you go to our sbs exclusive section just as an example and um let's see if we can pull that up yeah we've got this pulled up we go to the sbs exclusive section and i mean i'm just trying to show you just an example of you know high to low price okay here you got some crazy crazy expensive stuff like here's two a set of two one ounce silver bars for five thousand dollars well that's twenty five hundred dollars an ounce for silver well that's ridiculous right but these impex bars are very difficult to find each of these are only 100 minted and they rarely ever pop up for sale right but i always have them available here on the website (laughs) in this case they're five thousand dollars but i mean i'm showing you all the crazy expensive stuff here because this is this is the sps exclusive section and it's the high highest price stuff in the sps exclusive section if you go to sps exclusives and you go to the low price stuff i mean here we've got a factory sealed uh johnson matthew bar for 38 bucks out the door that's not too bad actually and that's in the SBS exclusive section because it's a factory seal, right? So anything that's kind of exclusive to SBS, it's kind of like an exclusive one-off, one-of-a-kind sort of piece, or if it's factory sealed, or if it's sequential cereals, or if there's just something, you know, if it's a full set of prospectors every single year, something like that, full fractional prospector set, these types of things are the things that you would find in the SBS exclusive section. You see a lot of crazy one-off stuff, original factory seal stuff, curated sets things like that is what you'll find here in the sbs exclusive section if you want to find a deal on stuff then that's when you go to the sale section right we've got a whole sale page and we've actually got a whole bunch of curated options here as well starting off Uh, every time you go to any page you'll see these sort of mystery boxes and and bins you know curated sbs curated bins that we've got and these are our most popular products i mean right here you've got our sbs black and mild box top mystery box let me tell you a little bit about this this right here is our cheapest uh mystery box uh, offering it's basically it's 10 bucks 
flat and you get four grams of random design silver and it's usually going to be some cheaper more generic types of silver because it's a pretty cheap box a pretty accessible box ten dollar out the door free ship everything comes comes to your door for ten bucks for four grams of silver so this is something that was inspired actually by a black and mild connoisseur they like their black and milds and they get on the box tops every once in a while they'll get a ten dollar gift card <laughs> a ten dollar visa prepaid gift card which they make a pain in the butt to use right and so this customer reached out to me they said hey i've got all these ten ten dollar gift cards i want to use and they make a big, big pain in the butt to use them because I can't. They make all these stipulations on how I can use them. It's got to be online purchase, this, that, whatever. It's got to be exactly ten dollars. So, I was saying, hey, I could set up a listing for you for exactly ten dollars, and I'll give you four grams of silver. And so he's got a huge stack of these ten dollar Visa prepaid gift cards, and at his own leisure, he'll just cash in his gift cards for, for some tangible silver, right? And he just cashes five, ten at a time, and he's got his friends who also are black and mild smokers uh, picking up these $10 gift cards and using them. And so this is a very accessible way for them to just pick up regular, uh, a regular silver bullion offering with uh, money that would have otherwise basically probably just been wasted on bullcrap, right? So this right here is our cheapest mystery box offering, but we've also got some more premium stuff available as well. Now, one of our most popular offerings is going to be our premium junk bin, and that's not going to be like junk silver. That's going to be pure 999 bullion, but what it's going to be is it's going to just be something that's nice, right? It's going to be random design like generic, but most places you get a random random design uh, silver round or bar, they'll give you like a generic buffalo or something like that. We don't even have buffaloes in stock. You know, I might give you premium junk bin. Last thing I gave somebody to somebody, some, somebody something to somebody, it was just the last week or the week before, was a couple backdated maples. They were very, very pleased with what they got there because I think the pricing was still around $32 at that time. So for $32, bucks, they got themselves two units of this uh, premium junk bin, and they ended up getting a nice set of backdated maples and they were very happy about that and I think they also picked up one of these one gram HQ frack bins which is just a gram of premium silver I don't know if it was 325 at that time or how much they paid but they got a nice little Geiger one gram serialized silver bar there and so they were very happy about that too I mean we sell those for I think more than five dollars on our website right now I mean I can go check right now what do we sell the Geiger one gram bars for let's just do a search for that Geiger Geiger one gram silver bars. Oh, it was right back there. See, we sell just the single bar for five dollars and twenty-five cents, which actually is quite a good deal, honestly, if you think about it. I mean, the Abmex probably sells this for over ten bucks. One of these one gram bars, right? I'm and they'll then they'll charge you shipping on top of that as well. So you know, you can get a one gram fractional for five twenty-five, but because that savvy stacker ended up taking advantage of our uh, one gram HQ AG frack bin, they got a single gram. They got a Geiger frack on there. I mean, you're not always going to get a Geiger frack. You might get something else sometime. Maybe you'll get an SBS Slim Stacker, which is our proprietary one gram silver bar. But I'm just saying, that's kind of how these mystery bins, mystery boxes, and these um, junk, and these, um, sorry, these SBS curated bins and these mystery boxes sort of work, right? Let me give you an example of the last thing we gave out because we've got a SPS rare vintage bin, right? So the premium junk bin I talked to you about, those 32 bucks, somebody got backdated maples on the last one. Maybe you'll get a factory sealed maple on the next one, you know? Um, SPS vintage bin is going to be your next step up, right? So $32 an ounce is really the cheapest thing on the website. $34.50, tack on another $2.50, and you'll be guaranteed to get yourself some vintage, like a prospect around, an Engelhardt or JM bar, or something very comparable to that, anything that you see here in, in this picture, right? So a lot, this is another popular offering because this is kind of cheaper than any of our prospector listings or anything like that. So you can come out ahead, might end up with a prospector or an Inglehard bar for way cheaper than we actually sell them for on our website. So these vintage bins and these premium junk bins are really some things to take advantage of. And we have a lot of very expensive things. There's a lot of things on our website that cost more than $100 an ounce. Many things. Very many things. And you'll see that if you actually pay attention to the market, those things regularly sell also for over, over $100 an ounce as well and so take a look at this we've got an SPS rare vintage bin and this is something that some of our daring customers who are kind of loyal customers who regularly purchase from us and know that we're not bullshitting at all really uh, they like to roll the dice on the rare vintage bin now let me give you an example of what happened the last time somebody opted into the rare vintage bin it was still I think $95 an ounce and they ordered three units of this 
right? Now, what happens on any of these bins is if you order multiple units, let's say if you order 10 units of the, uh, you know, the the regular vintage bin, the SBS vintage bin, I'm, you might end up with a 10 ounce bar or two five ounce bars. It's possible, right? That's stated in the description. So same goes for this. In the SBS rare vintage bin, this individual purchased three units. So they purchased three ounces. Now I could have given them like a two ounce bar, maybe like one of those oval two ounce single heart Australia bars, and then maybe some crazy rare, you know, rounder bar, you know, and it would have been roughly $300 value. I mean, based off of, you know, it would actually have been more than a $300 value because you're getting it. You're getting a deal on the SPS rare vintage bin. So it'd be closer to like, you know, this is 145 an ounce. So it'd be a lot, a lot more than a $300 value if you're actually buying three, three units of this. So anyways, he bought three units of that. I could have given him three crazy rare one ounce bars and rounds. Instead, what I chose to do, and I was just thinking that he might appreciate it because I, I, I myself appreciate, I would appreciate if I was getting this. I ended up giving him a three ounce poured silver bar and this was a actually johnson matthew 5000 minted three ounce johnson matthew cast poured silver bar with the jmc maple leaf logo on the front so this is something we sell for 600 bucks now i'm not going to say that these always sell for 600 bucks uh that's what we you know based off our cost basis and our availability for this item that's what we sell this for. It's not even on sale right now. That's just kind of the regular price. A lot of our items on our website are actually on sale. So this is a, an item that happens to not be on sale and happens to be very, very expensive. I mean, for a three ounce bar, $600, that's freaking $200 an ounce. It's very expensive. So, I mean, if you want the item, it's available here, but I, I wouldn't personally purchase this at that price. I mean, we've gotten them for cheaper than that, but not much cheaper than that. And that's why that's our price. But one thing I will note and will tell you is that the market value for this is not around $600. I would say the market value for this is in the current present time, like if we're talking this month, the market value for that is closer to like $375, 350 to 375 And the reason I'm telling you that is because I just saw a bar identical to this go up on auction, on an open auction, and it ended up closing at around 350 to 375 I'm kind of actually kicking myself that I myself didn't uh, win that, but um, I wasn't really actually gunning after it. But that's a very good price in my opinion, and that's sort of what the market price would be for that. So anyways, 350 to 375 for a three ounce bar, that's still over $100 an ounce. And that's the bar I ended up giving our customer when they purchased three units of the premium vintage bin, of the rare vintage bin right so they were actually ecstatic to end up with that item and i don't think they were expecting to get that item they were probably expecting to get some pressed bars or something but they ended up with a three ounce poured jmc bar so this is the, the reason i'm telling you this is because i'm trying to give you examples of the types of things realistically that I, people end up with right that's what's happened in the past month we've had a couple customers if they're you know members here on youtube they could chime in and let them know yep that's the thing i got <laughs> he's not bullshitting uh or or not whatever it is what it is if you want to take a stab at it th those are available and these are kind of going to be a lot of the better value items on our website now one of the benefits of the silver bar stacker website i would say is that we have everything available and more right in the sbs exclusive section you'll find crazy crazy one-of-a-kind stuff original factory seals sequential cereals curated sets all sorts of stuff like that here in the sbs exclusive section but if you just go to the normal silver section right you will find everything you can imagine and you can filter out by um the actual <clears throat> categories and then you can also search by the refiner as well so you go to the shop all page and then you've got even more filters here available if you want to just search for all the angle hard stuff here's all the angle hard stuff available every single thing by angle hard available and the pages just go on and on and on and on and on you could just keep going and going and going and going and going we have everything everything you could possibly imagine by Ingo Hart and Johnson Matthew. Okay, so this is one thing I wanted to show you, of course. I wanted to introduce you to the website, show you that, hey, it's very, very populated. Everything's available. Everything has been priced very, very competitively. But one other thing that I wanted to let you know about and one thing I want you to keep kind of checking back on the website for is this blog section here at the very end. Here we are starting to sort of do write-ups for some of the different 
products that we have available on the website and we sort of give you a little bit more additional information about these and give you a little bit of background behind them so for example here we've got an article regarding the Inglehart Australia one ounce press bars each of these bars is a 500 minted bar okay and there's very very slight variations between the bars now we've got each of these bars available you can buy them as a set for a little bit cheaper or you could buy them individually for a little bit more expensive but we've got each of these examples available but if you don't want to buy them and you just want to learn about them and then maybe you know in the future you might want to pick one up or something then you can read about them you know we've got a small blog post here uh, it tells you a little bit about them it sort of explains the difference between each of them right and so a lot of this information you can find on allingoart.com but we've kind of consolidated the information here specifically about the items that we are interested in right and so that way people can keep checking back even if they're kind of googling things these blog posts will sort of pop populate and, and show up and people will be able to get a little bit more information accurate information as far as what we've researched regarding these items and so i want this to be kind of a one-stop shop for you to be able to research items purchase items sell us items talk with community members I and mean, we've even got a community tab here which i wouldn't say is the most active but hey we've got people talking you know we've got people talking we've got people communicating and if you want to be an active community member and go there and strike up a conversation please do that would be fun right now as always we will be doing another whatnot auction this week i kind of have started sort of doing them sort of unannounced so one thing you're going to want to definitely do is go and follow us on whatnot.com forward slash user forward slash silver bar stacker um, because basically when i go live you'll basically be notified if you're following me and I'll, i will try to basically put my shows on the calendar like half an hour to an hour before i go live but you can expect that the same day that I do my video, usually I'll be doing a nice auction after after that point as well at some point. And so if you're following me, you'll be notified when I go live. And I've sort of shifted away from doing the mystery games and stuff like that. All these whatnot sellers love to do their mystery games, but I'm sort of tired of that. I want to keep things simple. I want to do things in a traditional auction format because, quite frankly, it confuses people when you do that sort of weird stuff. And so... When people come into my auctions, they will see I'm no bullshit. I've got my things available here. There's one chance to win each item. You either win it or you don't. Uh, you know, people either bid on it or they don't. And then those same exact items that I'll uh, that I'll be introducing each week, those same items will be marked down a little bit cheaper on my whatnot store just for during that show and so if you want to you know the, the items are going to cycle every single week we're going to have different items in the pool and there's going to be one chance to win each item on auction if you don't win that item i'll have duplicates available as a buy it now probably for a little bit more expensive than the auction closes that because everybody on whatnot's a cheapskate but uh it will definitely be less than what we sell it for like on our website or generally our normal price uh so if you want to have a chance at grabbing some cheaper uh, vintage we're going to have those opportunities literally every single week when we go live on whatnot you'll basically be able to get stuff as a buy now and you'll also be able to win stuff on auction and we'll have many many items available each week so there'll be many chances to win it's not just going to be a couple items and it's not going to just be one type of item we're not going to be just be doing fracks we're not going to just be doing prospector rounds we're not going to be just doing 10 ounce bars it's going to be a nice mixture of everything and i'm going to try to shuffle the offerings each week to keep it fresh and interesting right and we'll have some crazy crazy nice stuff every single week because we always have crazy nice stuff available right so be sure to follow us on whatnot.com and appreciate you very much and we'll see you next week basically we're going to start in the new year my goal is to be a little bit more structured right so every single week we're going to have a plan we're going to have a topic that we're going to talk about and throughout the week too you're going to see i've started making these blog posts i'm even going to have start making a lot of social media posts as well to just start informing the community about all these various pieces it's a lot of information to keep in mind so i think that if you keep sort of learning about things slowly and you start getting those little information feeds slowly but surely you will start sort of retaining that information and then when you see those items maybe at your local coin shop or maybe when you're browsing online or something maybe you might even be able to get some of these things for cheap like for example this right here you got a p prefix right well the p prefix is only a 10,000 minted bar as opposed to this one which is like 125,000 minted they look very similar but that p prefix means a lot and so if you knew that then you might be able to you know, if you see one up for a reasonable price, you might be able to get that for the same price that you get that for. 
right? And so the nice thing about the SPS website is that we always have things available. So if we sell through one thing, we'll still have availability for the next person. And so that's really the name of the game and the whole purpose of what I'm trying to do here with SPS. So thank you so much for tuning in. And I uh, wish you all a very happy new year and a wonderful work week ahead. Cheers.